And we've got another traffic alert for you this morning. Today, new equipment is coming in as the Convention Center expansion project continues to move forward. That means closures for you on Champa Street. 90s reporter John Glasgow live in downtown Denver this morning. John, there's a lot of exciting things in store for this new Convention Center. Yeah, that's right. They're adding a third crane on top of the convention center, and that's to make way for a new outdoor space that they hope will bring in new business to Denver. So as part of this, they're going to have to shut down Champa Street here for five days. This is between 14th and Spear, and that's to allow for them to put up this crane because it is a big one, and it's going to be needed to haul the steel in and around to get this construction going. So take a look at some of the renderings here. The plan is to add more than 200,000 square feet of space, about the size of four football fields. The city says that the biggest draw to attract new clients is going to be this outdoor space that will have the mountain views and the city views. And what they found from their research is that smaller meeting areas are more attractive attractive to businesses that are coming to Denver to network. The city hopes that this will generate about $85 million in economic impact yearly, something that it says that Denver needs after the slowdown from the pandemic. We're building an expansion on top of the existing roof of the facility. It's a 200,000 square foot uh, expansion that will, one of the great features of it is an outdoor terrace that will provide views of, of the mountains and the city. Our research shows that we're gonna see a return to those 2019 levels of business, which was really a great year for Denver in 2024. And this expansion is expected to be wrapped up and ready to go in late 2023. So the hope is that the hotels as well as the restaurants down here will also have some of the impact from that as well. And this project, they say, is on time. It's on budget. It's expected to wrap up just before 2024. As for the detours here, you can expect to make a left-hand turn here on 14th until Monday. That's when the crane will be up and ready to go. Send it back to you, Natasha. Yeah, those pictures look great. Very modern. I like the new additions that they're making. John, thank you.